Hey guys, great news for everyone who has ever thought about studying in Germany because now international students can study in Germany for free. I am bored. What should I do? Ah, ich weiß. Get Yes, you heard me right. You can study for free if you're an international student. For German students, studying inside of Germany has been free for quite a while now. No tuition fees whatsoever. Um, it is obviously not completely free. I will tell you in a minute why. But like the student fees that you have to pay like every six months, like 500 euros or whatever that you have to pay your university just for studying, um, they're gone. So you probably don't need a student loan anymore. Maybe you need one depending on like your, your financial background, your family background and stuff like that. But it is definitely, definitely a weight lifted off most people's hearts when they hear like, oh, you don't have to pay your tuition fees anymore, which in America, like what? $200,000 or something like that? I have no idea, but they always say how much it is in movies and stuff. And I'm always like, what? And um, obviously in Germany, it has not been that much before either. Like I said, 500 euros about that for six months or so. Um, but that is now gone as well, so you don't need to worry about that. Uh, like I said before, it is not completely free because obviously you have living costs, like you have rent costs in every city. Um, sometimes it is hard to find a job as a student because there are so many other students looking for a job in that particular town as well when there's a good university. Obviously then there are more students who want to study there. And there is like a little fee that you have to pay your university, but nothing compared to your student fee that you usually have to pay and uh, that includes like a student's ticket for the um, train service for the buses for the subways in your city pretty much in the entire state actually depending on where you study you get like a semester ticket it's called for the entire state you can use it on all trains on all buses um, on all subways and trams and whatsoever Mm, taxis are excluded I think but it's a pretty good deal pretty pretty sweet deal and uh, like I said that is included in like the 200 euros that you have to pay every six months um, and then there's a little service fee I think for the university just for handling stuff not really sure but um, obviously as a student in Germany you benefit greatly from other things as well for example you get to go to the movies cheaper sometimes or into the zoo or uh, just public things like that or museums sometimes you can even get in for free with a student's card so keep that in mind as well so it will save you money on the other end so studying in germany is now pretty much not even though if it's not completely for free it's very cheap compared to other countries i mean in finland or so i've heard they pay you for going to uni is that right i am actually not sure about that but like you get government support um, for going to uni i'm not sure if that's true so don't take my word for that but um, now in germany the deal is pretty sweet i would say pretty pretty good so if you have thought about studying in germany now is the time i think um now uh, you can afford it if you don't have all the money in the world to pay for like two hundred thousand dollar student loans or whatever or if you just don't want that like a student loan that you have to work off for the rest of your life. Come to Germany. Vielen Dank fürs Zusehen, guys. I hope you liked this little announcement video. I thought it is worth making one about this topic just because many of you might not have heard about that yet. Even though it's been out for like one or two weeks, that announcement, um, I just thought it's worth making another video about that or a video about that. So I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you found it useful. Show me if you found it useful by giving it a thumbs up or a thumbs down if you didn't find it useful. Mm, also check out my social networks in the video description and now it's time to look at some of your comments. Candy made of drugs says Dominic translate this, this is it. It has all come to this. Lock and load and Godspeed. That would be jetzt weit ist es gekommen, sichern und laden und viel Erfolg. Jetzt weit ist es gekommen, sichern und laden und viel Erfolg. Sarah Adam says I'm a little confused, does this mean that Germans almost always drink bottled sparkling water and not bottled still water. I personally can't stand sparkling water. Don't love the taste of bottled still water and avoid straight tap water too. My favorite water is basically tap water run through a filter attached to the kitchen faucet, special pitcher or through the refrigerator dispenser. I guess water filters aren't common in Germany. Well, um, we Germans like both sparkling and um, still like bottled water. Most Germans would, in my opinion, at least from what I've seen and heard, uh, prefer bottled water. For example, my parents almost always get bottled water crates, um, but I guess it's different for people who live like in the on the third floor or whatever, or for students who just want to 
live a bit cheaper, you know. Water filters are pretty, pretty common in Germany, I would say. I personally have like a little bottle at home with a filter attached to it, but they might not be as common as in other countries. For example, in America, they would probably have way more filters than that, but then again, I'm not really sure, so um, yeah. OPL500 says, is der Leitungswasser sicher zu trinken? It, it's das Leitungswasser, and um, yes, it is very safe to drink tap water in Germany. It is one of the most looked after like foods, I guess, or drinks, whatever you want to say. It's, it's like the controls are very strict and it's very clean and you can drink it without having to worry about anything. Like in other countries where you might get sick when you drink it, that won't happen to you in Germany. That's it with the comments, guys. Vielen Dank fürs Zusehen. Don't forget to get Germanized. Goodbye and auf Wiedersehen.